Bum 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 bum. Tomatoes. Hello, welcome to video four. What is game user settings? The is dirty nodes. Now this video is going to cover three different nodes. We have a is full screen mode dirty. We have the is screen resolution dirty. And then hiding down here somewhere, we have the is vsync dirty. These nodes are intended to tell us if we have basically pending changes in our game user settings for the full screen mode, the resolution or the vsync that we should pay attention to. Basically, do we want to change this resolution? Has someone requested a change? Is our game user settings dirty? It's not clean. There has been a change to it that's pending and we should do something on it. Let me show you what I mean by this. Let's hit play. And right now, these are my default settings. We can see we're in windowed. We can see we're in 1280 by 720. And we can see vSync is off. If I was to change any of those options, we're going to get a true or false in the top left corner. Let me full screen this. Uh, let's go back to that. Okay. We're going to get a true or false. Basically, it's going to tell me if it's dirty. So if I click vSync, now we're dirty. vSync is not matching. We uncheck it. We're false. This is the original vSync setting, so we don't need to worry about it. We go to full screen. We're true. Maximize window. True. Window. False. Change our resolution to something else. True. Change it back to what we are. We're now false. Basically, the game user settings for those full screen mode, resolution mode, and vSync do not match, and they are dirty. We should do something about it. Now, what might we use this for? Well, let's say I hit accept, and it says apply new settings. We hit yes. Well, nothing changes. I didn't really change anything. It's just our default pop-up. However, if I change my resolution, let's go with something like Oh, 1440 by 900. We'll see we have true. And I hit accept. Well, now it says apply new settings, 1440 by 900 window. We hit yes, and now we have our new one. We go back to 1280 by 720. Now it says true. And 1440 by 900 is false because this is our current setting. What I'm doing in there is when I find my accept button, it's hidden somewhere in this massive amount of things. There we go. Wait, that's the accept button. Okay. So what I'm doing with my accept button is I'm popping up a little bit of a window. When that window pops up, I check to see if it's dirty, which is oh, my audio ones. There's my settings ones. Oh, you got to love stuff like this when I start hiding things in here. OK, so here's my accept button. It gets the game settings. It validates it. It sets the text. There we go. Get new video settings right here. So what I'm doing is I'm getting the game user settings when they hit accept. I'm checking to see if it's dirty. And I actually apologize. There were four of them. I totally forgot about that. I'm used to just the three. But there is a general is dirty node. I forgot about that one because it's an all encompassing. Basically, you have your vSync full screen and screen resolution nodes. And then you have your is dirty, which actually checks all the other three. So is dirty will fire off if any of these are dirty. These individual ones will only fire if the individual parts are dirty. So what I'm doing is getting the game user settings, checking to see if any of them are dirty by just doing is dirty. This is going to return back a true or a false. If it's false, I just say, OK, well, go ahead and ask them if they want to apply the settings. If it's true, I'm getting the screen resolution and full screen modes because they've now changed it. They've decided they wanted something different. And I'm asking them, are you sure you want something different? and I'm presenting them with the new resolution. So like in this case, 1440 by 900, except do you just simply want to apply? Yes or no? 1280 by 720, it's now dirty. It's a different resolution. I hit accept and it asks them, are you sure you want to try this new one? So it's a nice way of verifying if the player wants to actually change the resolution. You may also want to do some safety checks such as, you know, I'm in here and I'm changing settings like this and I'm changing my quality settings. This is going to affect performance. I hit accept, I hit yes, and it's going to change some things in here. However, if I need to do this, here we go. So let's say we go in here and we'll do some changes like that. And we'll hit accept. You'll notice I'm changing the quality settings. We'll go all epic. The worst thing that's going to happen with quality settings is the game's going to slow down. However, if you change the resolution, you change the vSync, or you change things such as full screen, with a weird resolution, 
the monitor may go out of sync or it may cause an issue if they have multiple screens. So you kind of want to be very careful when you're messing around with the resolution and give the player a safety net. Basically, oops, I changed the resolution. Now I can't see anything on the screen. Let's wait five seconds, revert it because the player screwed up. You only really want to do that when it's changing the resolution. So that's why the dirty nodes only really apply to those. So you might, in this case, for example, after we've changed, we've verified they're dirty. After we've asked them if they want to change, we may want to set up a timer that flips a Boolean that says, yes, they've confirmed that this is a valid resolution or no, they've confirmed that it's failed and they don't want to save it. But you really don't want to do that if they're messing with their graphical settings. That's just going to slow it down. You do want to do something like that if they're doing it with their resolution settings because it may cause the monitor to have an issue. So long story short, short, well, technically this is six minutes in. So long story long, short story long. Let's go a short story long. Short node long, four short nodes long. Let's go with that. These nodes are useful if your player is going to try to change their resolution, their full screen mode, their vSync mode, or in the case of is dirty, one of the three or all of the three or two of the three. And you may want to do some extra safety checks. That is going to wrap up our is dirty nodes. Remember there are four of them, vSync, screen resolution, full screen mode, which does include windowed, remember, and then is dirty, which is one, two, or three of these being true, we'll return back true. All of them being false, we'll return back false. 